become more energy independent, all while improving our national security. It's called the Fractal Grid, and we have an exclusive look at how this system, uh, how it works. Uh, San Diego 6's Carlos Correa is here, and Carlos, the grid also going to improve the environment. That's right, and it was installed over the summer and is 100% renewable. It allows Camp Pendleton to remain fully functional in the event of a utility grid interruption or worse, if the base is under attack. Um, you can go in, you can look up historical events. With just a touch of a finger, Camp Pendleton is keeping a close eye on its new 1.1 megawatt microgrid. And you can do comparisons of different points. It's called the Fractal Grid. It provides energy security to critical facilities within the base using renewable energy. Energy security really is the underlying essence of the military's ability to, uh, to work and operate. And so energy security is very synonymous with national security. The grid includes 15 concentrated photovoltaic or CPV panels. They stand 10 feet tall, 30 feet wide, weighing about 7,500 pounds, each carrying 17.8 kilowatts of power. Several years ago, we did our energy strategy, and we determined that we would put a microgrid on every one of the eight bases. And we're well on our way to doing that. The system is new to the military. It gives the base independence from the current electric grid operated by the utilities. Through flywheel technology, the fractal grid provides energy when it's needed. After the, uh, the power outage in Southern California in 2011, we had 12 hours where the, the uh, area was without power. Now, if you're flying an F-18 out of Miramar and the base loses power, it's going to make it very difficult to control that aircraft. The grid reduces greenhouse gas emissions and increases the way the military continues to protect our freedom. If, we're, if we can be more efficient in how we use energy, then our forces are lighter, they're faster, they have more operational reach, and really we're saving more money so that we can invest it more in training our Marines. Clean Spark is the company that oversees the system on base. There is hope to install the grid at other bases down the road. In studio, Carlos Correa, San Diego, 6 News. Interesting.